Hey guys, make my school lunch with me for tomorrow. I'm just gonna use the scissor salad kit that I got from HEB, but I'm gonna wash it in this. Okay, so I'm just dumping all the leaves or lettuce leaves into the bowl. Round two of spinning it, cause yeah. Okay, I just put the salad in here with the dressing Ow. and the croutons. So this is my lunchbox and I'm just gonna put my salad right here. Now I'm gonna make some chamoy tahini gushers, which is so random, but I'm gonna put it in this little thing. Okay, gushers are in and now I'm gonna put some chamoy. Okay, so now some tahini. Oh! Mix that up. Okay, boom. I'm gonna put them in right there. Now I'm gonna pack some cotton candy grapes in this thing. Okay, there's the cotton candy grapes. Now I'm either gonna bring these Doritos or the Cheez-Its. I think like Cheez-Its are less loud as a snack during school, so I'll probably bring the Cheez-Its. Now I'm going with Doritos. Okay, that's what we got. I'm also packing a spoon and a fork, and I don't know why they're gold. Okay, so I have a salad, cotton candy grapes, chamoy gushers, some chips, and silverware. Okay, that's my lunch. Hi everyone, pack a college lunch with me for class tomorrow. So I start off by making this basil tomato pasta. I literally make it like at least twice a week. I start off with adding about this much cream cheese, pasta sauce, and all of the seasonings you see here. It hits every single time, never misses. I got this heart-shaped pasta from Aldi around Valentine's Day. I'm obsessed with it. But anyways, then I'll have like a little charcuterie board moment. This container is linked in my Amazon storefront, by the way, this glass container. But I'll add an applesauce, a baby bell cheese, some pretzels, and then some saltine crackers to go with the cheese. I have med surge first thing tomorrow morning, and I have a short break after that, which is when I'll probably eat the snacks in this container. And then I also have patho and farm and a longer break in between there, which is when I'll eat the pasta. But anyways, then I packed Cheez-Its and veggie straws, and that's it. Korean glass noodles and kimchi dumplings. <laughs> Tofu kimbap. This is not sushi. Kimbap is seasoned with sesame oil for a totally different flavor profile. Dubu joram. Korean spicy braised tofu with purple rice. So delicious. Don't forget the extra sauce. All done. Here's what I packed in my college lunch for tomorrow. I decided to make an everything bagel sandwich, so I started by spreading a layer of pesto on both sides of my bagel. Then I added some lettuce, 
You can add whatever meat you like. I only had ham, but I think turkey would taste better on the sandwich. And I don't have sliced cheese, only shredded, but that's good enough. And I just cut that in half. These bento boxes are linked in my Amazon storefront. I put half of my sandwich in there. And don't y'all worry, the other half is not going to waste. I'm going to eat it like before practice or something. Then I grabbed a handful of strawberries, washed and cut them into halves. Then I added those to another compartment in my little bento box. Then for a little sweet treat, I added some chocolate covered almonds. I did not notice that these were dark chocolate when I picked them up at the store. So I'm kind of sad because I prefer milk chocolate. But apparently dark chocolate is better for you anyway, so... Here's the finished bento box. I threw that in my lunchbox and continued packing some snacks. I packed some honey teddy grams and orange mango body armor. And these spicy queso popcorn chips that are delicious. Just packed what was left in the bag and that was it. Pack my lunch with me for the first day of school. Here's my lunchbox. It's the same one that I used last year. I filmed some of it, but I had to delete that part. Some berries in here. There's blackberries, raspberries, and blueberries in this little container. And I have a whole set of these in different sizes. They're so freaking cute look at them this is a tiny one let's put some raisins in there okay let's open these i like raisins a lot of people don't like them and i don't know why i just i don't really want to have to deal with any trash so i'm just gonna pour the box into here i have not eaten these forever i forgot sometimes you have to like dig them out all right we got them all out so let's put the lid on oh, oh. i don't know why i just gasped like that the lid was not going on i was afraid it was gonna like spill everywhere we're gonna use another medium-sized container for the carrots i have two of these two of these and then whoa <laughs> and then one big one baby carrots are so good is there anyone else calling that oh that's what they're called i guess on the package i just knocked on my door oh, it's one of my brother's friends all right back to the lunch i'm gonna pick out the carrots that look good this one does not look good look at this one all right i think this should be enough Okay, I don't know if I should put anything else in here. I am gonna put a few granola bars in my backpack just for like a snack throughout the week. Let's check the fridge to see if we have anything else. We do have some strawberries, but I think I'm gonna eat some of those for breakfast. Since I'll probably eat a pretty good breakfast tomorrow, I don't think I'll be super hungry. So this is what I'm gonna pack. And then again, if I am hungry, I'll have a granola bar in my bag. Also, we have like a concession stand in the little like lobby that I eat in. So if I get hungry, then I can always just go like buy a bag of chips or something. Okay, I'm gonna put this in the fridge and then tomorrow morning I'll get an ice pack out of the freezer and put it in here. I'm also gonna make a get ready with me for the first day of school video tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. But anyways, thank you so much for watching.